David, how physical was this game? Uh, it was a very physical game. You know, um, credit to them. They're you know a real tough team. Uh, they play hard, uh, play fast. I mean, it was, it was a real physical game, and uh, Russ was letting us play. Jalen, can you take us through the play where DeJuan drove and lost the ball when you guys were down one? Uh, no, it was just a, a play we drew up, and it was going to be open, but, you know, things happened during the game, and that's just what happened. Jalen, when teams focus on denying a <clears throat> tie, how does that create other opportunities for you guys to score points? Uh, I mean, when they do that, it kind of uh, takes away their healthy defense, so it allows us to drive off of them and stuff like that. And, Kind of get easier buckets, so it's not helping at all. And I have to deny the ball at all. So when they do that, we just got to take advantage of it. David, what, you, what, what was kind of the scouting report about Timmy Allen and Trey Mitchell coming in? Um, Allen, we know he was he was great off the ball as far as cutting. We know he had a, a solid mid range game, and um, he was just kind of you know real crafty as an offensive player. And then uh, Mitchell, we knew he was um, very versatile, going over both shoulders and um, he kind of shoot. So that was just kind of what we really needed to play to and just try to uh, hone in on that defensively. Were you guys expecting the excess to bring the game they did tonight? I mean, we respect every opponent that, you know, they played to their strengths. And I think um, they did a good job uh, rebounding ball. We know there was a strong rebounding team as well. Um, There's just credit to their performance. I think they just had a high hand. Dave, when you sat with two fouls, I think 10 minutes or so in the first half, what was the conversation when you went back in and played with two? Uh, just playing with my head on my feet, playing smart. Um, no, not to get any, any dumb fouls, and, but still try to play strong, play physical, like every time the game was. And I was really a coach was allowing me to play, uh, but knowing I'll play responsibly. The way Mitchell did what he did when you were sitting, did you feel like you had to be out there? Uh, definitely. You know, it was it was hard to watch just knowing uh, what he can do and how I can bring a defensive presence. But just, you know, that's the terrible thing about foul trouble. You, you got to try to reserve yourself for later in the game. Jim, how much credit did you give Ramey for, you know, holding Ochai down? I mean, he did what he was supposed to do. I, I'm assuming that was his role for this game, but not worried about anything else. I'm trying to take out you know, one of the best players in the country. So mm-hmm. I think any, any team would, would try to do that. And, it's just on us. We got to step up when guys playing like that. I mean, it's, it's, it's not up to him to, you know, face the whole file. I mean, they're all keen in on him, so it's up to us to step up. When you guys, you kind of lead late. What's going to be the biggest regrets just after that one? Uh, just, just execute the play. We, we had the game. We just kind of made some mistakes and, uh, and delayed, and that's that's when you have to tighten up everything. Was the crowd a factor at all? No. No. Uh, when you're inside the four lines, it's just tight huddles and make sure you execute what you need to do. Jaden, how do you explain the turnovers in the first half? That's unusual for you guys. Uh, just, just kidding. I think my, my, I think my turnover in the first half was kind of the, I mean that, that set the tone for the whole second half. I let them have a five point swing after that. So, uh, just, just, just got a lot in more. Jaden, also too, you guys you almost shot, almost shoot sixty percent tonight in a losing effort against. You know, they talk about being the number one scoring defense. How much was that a factor and to shoot so well? And, and I mean, it just, it just. It just shows like we, we we did some good things, of course, you know, obviously not enough, but with a team like that and always being on the road, you have to take advantage of, of when you're up and when you have the ball and time management. We uh we just gotta learn from that that level. When, when you guys have been in that situation this year before, you know, down one or whatever tied late, you usually made that play to win the game. is there a little shock at all that it didn't deliver tonight? Um <laughs> I mean, it, it's just it's just how it goes. I mean, that with the the plays that happened late, you know, they got some good plays and we made some bad plays. And no matter how it goes, it just it just comes down to the last the last few minutes, and uh, they were able to win those minutes. Hey Dave, were you expecting Trey to play to a pick and pop? You guys are a fourth and minute left. Um, I know he he was shooting them a lot all game, and I was just kind of not trying to give him any dare shots, but uh, just allowing him to shoot it, and you know. Um, when you put up enough shots, you know, someone was just going to happen to go in, he, he banked that in. And yeah, what do you think when he banks that one in? It's just our luck, you know, that's the last thing we wanted. And, um, you know, it, it was kind of a dagger, but, you know, we can we still had time to recover from it and still play to uh, play win the game. Did all the guys lob to you, too? I mean, did that seem open from your end, that uh, next possession? Yeah, it was, it was an open lob. It was just probably a mishandled ball slip, something like that. Um, but it was just, you know, something that, again, there was still time to recover from like that, but it was just misplay, still uh, more time to get back to the game.